Hi everyone, I'm back and I'm here to unbox and review a pair of Sperry's that I re recently purchased. These are the Crest TG Platform White Canvas Shoes in size 7.5, which is my normal size that I wear for mostly all shoes, including Sperry's. what's inside. As expected, this is a fairly easy unboxing. You just take the shoes out and put the wrapping paper back in. Surprisingly, these shoes actually don't have any of the paper um, inside them. Usually I feel like they include that, but I guess they must have forgotten for this pair. So this is what the shoes look like. I previously and I currently, I previously purchased uh, the same shoe without the platform. And so the platform really adds about like an inch, an inch and a half to the shoe. These are one of my favorite Sperry sneakers to wear. They're super easy to put on and um, they're, they basically just slip on, are very comfortable. And the white color really just adds a great um, like pop of color to your outfits and it matches virtually any any outfit you wear. So I do love that. Let's take a closer look at the shoe itself. So the shoe here, starting from the back, has the Sperry logo in a navy color, as well as this little accent here of navy and red. It does have this little hook here for you to really, um, to help you put your shoes on. So I know a lot of people like that, so you don't have to bend over um, as much to put the shoe on. Over here, you have the Sperry logo in navy. And that's pretty much it. So you'll look here um, towards the platform section. It's a pretty hard rubber. You'll see a little bit of like little grooves, like these lines in there that just add to really the classiness or how the, the shoe looks. Um, you have this elastic area here to help with fit and so that um, it's easy and comfortable for you. There's a little bit of what looks like navy lint on there. So just taking that off. Inside the sole is memory foam. It's very comfortable and um, you can tell when you press on it, there is some give to it. So um, it's great for people who really like a little bit of cushion and don't really want a really hard sole. I know certain companies that wear, make white shoes tend to make really heavy shoes and those shoes also barely have any um, I guess like memory foam on the bottom. So this is definitely not the case, which I love. Looking at the heaviness of the shoe, it is a little heavy, I'm not gonna lie, but it's definitely not as heavy as some other platform white shoes that you might see um, in stores or online. I'm going to quickly show you what these shoes would look like if they didn't have the platform. And I'll link a video to these Crest, Crest, uh, TG white twisted shoes, um, which I previously did unbox and review for this channel. So essentially this is, this shoe's a little bit different because it's a different color, but other than that, it's the same type of shoe. All the biggest difference is the platform. And of course the little accent color, since it's a different, um, design but you can kind of compare how the shoe would look with and without the platform here. I previously, um, and one of my favorite shoes that I currently like to use, wear is actually this shoe without the platform and without this new um, trendy color. So I had the old color, which was just the basic white and navy, navy line. Um, so this is very interesting that this shoe actually has like these little transitions where they're grippy. So like they're grippy at the bottom of the shoe, it's grippy towards the top, but in the middle and on top, it's not actually grippy. So it's actually quite just, it's just a material without grip. So I'm not sure why they did that or if they just felt like the shoe really only needed grip at the, towards the middle and the end. But that's just something interesting to know. Other than that, um, there is the classic Sperry symbol throughout um, the bottom as well as the bigger logo um, over here, navy. 
I'm curious to know why they did this. So if anyone does know the reason or have other pair of Sperry's that doesn't have um, grip all throughout the bottom, let me know because I really haven't seen that before. And I noticed that on both sides or, or both shoes. So I know it's not just like an error where one sneaker or one shoe has it and the other doesn't. All right, so let me try these on and show you how they look as well as how I feel in them. Okay, so since these are super easy and quick to put on, I figured I would just show you how you put them on, which I'm sure you can figure out yourself as well. You just slide the shoe in. Um, it looks like for this one, my foot's not going in correctly. So what I'll do is I'll just use this little um, thing here to just help me put the shoe on. Super easy to put on, very comfortable. At first initial impression of these shoes, since I haven't owned these platform shoes before, which does make you feel taller personally. I feel like I'm a little higher. Um, these aren't heels, of course, so you're not gonna feel like wobbly or super high. Um, but I do think they're very cute. They're very, um, they're very comfortable. I don't think you need any kind of break-in period. There's really nothing hurting or like tugging on my skin anywhere. I'm gonna walk back and forth in them just to show you how they look. So I didn't just see that one of my foots was about to slip out of the shoe. I, I wonder if that's because they're a little bit heavier than the normal not platform shoe. So maybe the heaviness from the bottom kind of pulls down. And I noticed that again right now I don't think that's a huge issue. I think that's something that over time your foot might just um, become more comfortable with and it won't really slide out as much. Let's see, walking, feel very supported, very comfortable. The bottom of the shoe, I do feel like in certain um, areas, because it's not fully gripped, it might be easier to slip because normal Sperry's, when I, when I have my foot down like this, I have to intentionally move my foot. But with this one, I can just lightly move my foot and it like kind of, it doesn't really have that much grip to keep me in place. So definitely keep that in mind if you're one of those that likes to go out in nature a lot or live in an area that might have ice during the winter. I don't think these are really good winter shoes, but you if you happen to wear them, just know that there's not there's not grip all across the bottom, so that could that could be concerning, especially if you're even in the grocery store and there happens to be a water spill. I don't I don't think that these would be the best for that. So that's just something to keep in mind. I think with the platform, these shoes are more day to day, everyday wear, but only for instances where you want that extra platform height, or if you're not going to go do anything crazy or even go to the grocery store when there could be an accidental slip. I think not having that grip is just really important and I don't know, I think that might bother me a little bit. Um, but other than that, I think the shoes are very cute. They're very comfortable. They're not at all super heavy. I'm not gonna lie that they're definitely heavier than the non platform, but that's expected because it's a completely different shoe. In order to create that platform, they do have to add a little bit more weight and rubber down there. I'm trying to see if I can slip. I can't actually. So like if I'm trying to just like slip on purpose, the grip does a pretty good job. And I think the grip right here is really um, good. And so it really prevents you from slipping. And so that's just the issue, the small issue that I had with the bottom, which I guess now that I'm thinking of it really isn't that big of a deal. Take a quick look at the side, both sides, the back. These are very comfortable shoes. I feel very well supported and I think that they would look great with any outfit. Um, I'm definitely keeping these, uh, adding them to my Sperry's collection. Sperry's canvas shoes are really one of my favorite canvas shoes that I own. They're super versatile and I really love all of them. It's my first time purchasing the platform ones, but I think that they really could be worn every day. Um, I think of my foot will just have to get used to the little bit heavier weight just to make sure it doesn't like slip out. And in the beginning when I'm wearing these, I just have to be a little bit more cognizant of the less grip or rubberized 
bottom here just to make sure and see if that's going to be an issue. And if it is an issue, I'll definitely make a separate video and let you guys know. I don't anticipate it being a huge issue, but if it is, I will let you guys know to kind of stay back and be aware of this. All right, well, that's it. Like, subscribe, let me know if you have any questions, um, and thank you.